welcome back dear friends inside this class we are going to discuss about loop it means number three while loop so open the code editor uh, first i'm going to remove all this from here so i will just keep one of them just till here and this is the for loop now i'm just going to show you what is the difference between for loop and while loop so both of them will give the same result but the way of creating a loop will be different i have just told you before also this in this the left side windows you can just see while loop windows you can see this is the while loop and this is the for loop so in for loop we have we are writing this for keyword at first then you have a parenthesis inside this parenthesis you are declaring the variable you are just setting the starting point the ending point and you are incrementing or decrementing and after that inside this curly braces you have this message but inside while loop first you are going to declare a variable with a starting point then uh, you are writing the while keyword then inside this parenthesis or round bracket you are setting the ending point of that variable and after this message you are you going to increment or decrement your loop so this is the big difference between while loop and for loop so i'm just going to remove this so we can just declare a variable you can see as i told you here inside this one variable x is equal to one you can just declare here variable x is equal to is equal to one then you are just writing here while in a round bracket inside this you are just saying x is less than 10 or you can say less than equal to 10 then a curly braces inside this you are going to write for example document dot write function and here we can just write anything for example uh, i'm just saying year number i'm just inside the quotation sorry for this year number then a column then i'm just using a space here then the name of your variable x so i'm just saying for example i want to the i want the year record for example from 1940 uh, till 2018 so i want this year record inside this one so we can save this let's check what we can do here open in browser and no display and this have a reason because you need to x plus plus you need to add decrement here we can save this now come here and refresh again we don't have any display and you can say a plus sign here for this one a refresh so year number 40 year 41 we can just use a br here inside this for the line break you can save and refresh so you can see year number 40 year number 41 so this is not a good way of using br here so we, we can just break this i'm just going to use here uh, another plus sign then these two uh, quotation you can say double quotation then you can use a br here to break the line you can save this and refresh so year number 40 1940 41 1942 1943 and year number 2018 so as i told you i uh, just uh, if you are working on for loop or if you are working uh, on while loop both loops will give the same result but the way of creating a loop will be different so you can see this is the big difference first we are declaring a variable with a starting point then uh, the ending point then the increment or decrement here for example if you want to add decrement here you can use two time uh, minus sign then you need to change the position here for example you want to write the 2018 here and the 1940 here and not a smaller sign because 2018 is greater than 1940 you can save this now come here and refresh so you can see 
now we have 2018 here at the first then 17 it is just increase decrementing you can see it 15 the last one is 1940 so this is just the way of creating while loop so i hope you are understand how you can create for loop inside javascript we are not going to make this video lengthy because i think you are understand so thank you for watching this video and see you in the next class